What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome back, guys. And welcome, 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 newbies. <clears throat> if you are new to my channel, Taurus, and you enjoy my content, if you could ring a little bell and buy my full job, I super duper appreciate it. Just saying, just saying, just saying. This is um, bi weekly reading for the sign of Taurus. This could resonate in your Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, or Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, I went over everything. Uh, free general reading. So, only take the messages that resonate with you. That's super duper important. Just saying, just saying, just saying. I didn't get any messages yet, but if I get any, I'll share them with you. Just saying. This could resonate in your Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. If you think anyone could benefit from these messages, Taurus, if you wouldn't mind sharing these on your social media, whatever social media platform you use, like Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, IG, Parlay, or Mayway, I would super appreciate it. In your top five spread, you have um, one major arcana, yeah, one major arcana, the Wheel of Fortune Upright, and you're dealing with one person, Emperor Upright. Let me get you some clarifying cards, and then I'll read it out. Spirit, can you clarify the Five of Swords upright, please, for Taurus? Spirit, can you clarify the Emperor Upright for Taurus, please? Someone's about to get a new pet. That's what I just heard. Someone's about to get a new pet. So for how that resonates for whatever Taurus is, someone, uh, apparently a Taurus is about to get a new pet or someone in Taurus's energy field. You take it how it resonates. No, I just heard pet. So, I, you know, that really could range a million different ways for a million different people. Spirit, uh, can you clarify the two of wands reverse for Taurus, please? <clears throat> Someone's about to get hit on. Someone's about to get hit on. That's what I heard. It's going to be very tempting. Okay, I heard it's going to be very tempting. So someone's about to get... Uh, obviously, that's not physical hitting. It's... um. You know, like hitting, like, uh, like, hey, baby, wanna go, wanna go for drinks, that kind of thing. I heard it's going to be very tempting. So, however, that resonates for whatever Taurus is. Just saying. Spirit, can you clarify the will of fortune upright for Taurus, please? Spirit, can you clarify the Five of Pentacles reverse for Taurus, please? I heard getting another one with this one. Spirit, can you clarify the Five of Pentacles reverse for Taurus, please? This is meant for December 15, 2020. However, there's millions of billions of people in the world and tons of Tauruses. For some of you guys, it can start resonating now. For some, December 15th through January of 2021. Some Jan January 2021. Some February 2021. On and on. Just saying. All right. Beginning your reading, we have Five of Swords Upright, which is um, conflict, conflict of Chaos. Someone's 
someone is about to get very jealous because you're getting lots of attention romantically from someone and they are very jealous okay I heard someone's about to get um, lots of attention from someone romantically it might be I heard earlier in here a choice is about to get hit on like hit on like hey baby want to go for drinks that kind of thing so but I heard some somebody else is gonna be very jealous that you're getting hit on by this person um, and it's gonna cause some conflict and chaos you know, if, it, if it's an employment situation, obviously that's going to cause a lot of drama in the employment situation. Or it could be any situation. Um, it could be in a group setting. It could be um, an employment situation. It could be family. Um, you take how it resonates. And then owl, good advice from a wise person. An older person older than you is really going to try to help you out sort this out okay I heard an older person older than you is really going to try to help you sort this out so I'm assuming the whole um, romantical situation over here somebody apparently is going to try to hit on a Taurus and it sounds like an older person older than you is going to try to help you um, sort it out I guess whether you should you know, reciprocate back with a romantic offer or not. You take it how it resonates. And then the Emperor Upright. Now, Emperor is awesome energy being. Um, it's very, very super awesome energy being. It's, um, some say it's just Aries energy, but I disagree. Any sign can be the Emperor. Um, it's how you manifest it inside yourself. It's a person, and they're upright, so they're not controlling or lack of self-confidence. They're upright. Um, it could be, it's also denoted like a person of authority in some type of way. So, um, it could be, um, a manager, a boss, a CEO, um, or, um, just a high person of the community of some type, um, like a doctor, a lawyer, a, um, investor, you know, you take it how it resonates. Clouds, temporary problems. For some Tauruses, this person is going to tempt you to go into business with them. And for some Tauruses, this is the person romantically interested in you. Okay, I heard for some Tauruses, this person um, in your life is a person that's going to tempt you to get into a business venture with them and for some Tauruses this is the person uh, that's going to that's romantically interested in you is I'm strongly feeling it's probably the person that's going to try to hit on you but you take it out resonates and then Apple temptation would test you so that could be with the business offer the business um, venture with this person or the romantical offer you take it out resonates and then two of wands reversed let me see not sure what two of wands reverse is focus on personal goals <clears throat> or the plans that you laid out for your career path are not going the way you expected Some Tauruses are about to lose a lot of money in bad investments. And some Tauruses are about to lose their job. Okay, I heard some Tauruses are about to lose a lot of money in bad investments. And some Tauruses are about to lose their job. Oh, God. Yikes. 
And then wreath sorrow over a loss. Yeah, that could be the bad investment or losing your job. However, that resonates. Yikes. And then wheel of fortune upright. Now the wheel of fortune upright is uh, the wheel spinning. It's turning, turning, turning. Um, it's turning, so that's good. But it can either go in your favor or not in your favor. Um, in this case, uh, it looks like for the ones that are losing um, in bad investments and um, about to lose their job, obviously it's not going to go in your favor. So, just saying. And then, um, shark, take care, or there will be a loss of material wealth. Yeah, God's all over the place in here. Um, losing a job and um, bad business invest, uh, bad business investments. And then, um, five of pentacles reversed. Now, that's coming out of the cold financially. Five of Pentacles upright is being left out in the cold financially, but this is reversed, so coming out of the cold financially, so that's good. Some will get unemployment. <clears throat> and some are going to get a windfall someone you never expected was going to help you okay so I heard some are going to get unemployment and some are going to um, gonna come into an unexpected windfall and that's wonderful I heard it's gonna be someone that you never thought um, would expect to help you and it looks like they're gonna help you financially um, no, it could be, you know, a gift. It could be, um, it could be an inheritance possibly that maybe you came into that you never expected to come into. Um, it could be and maybe another investment that did well possibly. You know, one's about to go bad. It looks over here for somebody, but maybe somebody else's investment goes well. Um, or, um, yeah, I mean, but you're going to be, uh, I heard some are going to get unemployment and some are going to um people or someone that unexpected so you, you would never expect this person to help you um but they're going to help you in some type of way and it's financially of some sort it could be just um, helping you like um bringing you groceries it could be um or maybe some other kind of assistance maybe it's information for assistance like in your community um you take it out resonates and then fair woman dealings a relationship with a woman with blonde gray or white hair so this could be very well be the person that unexpected that you never thought would help you or maybe they're delivering if y'all can see it maybe they're delivering information to you to get you some assistance in the community you take it how it resonates and then barrel you feel something is lacking in your life perhaps love money or goals Some, are, some Tauruses are going to meet a very unexpected person. Possible love interest through a, through a group soon. I heard some Tauruses are going to meet a very unexpected person. Um, ro possible romantical interest I heard through a group soon. So whatever group that is, um, it could be a group. Obviously, these COVID-19 days is probably a group on the internet because um, you know groups have been popping up all over the place um, uh, because that's the way we all do it these days now um, because it's hard to go out and physically meet people because uh, you have to maintain social distance so um, it could be that or it could be an actual physical 3D um, I know it's a lot harder these days but I mean I know some people still do that but um, you take it how it resonates but it hurts an unexpected person you're going to meet through a group a possible romantic interest so you take it how it resonates all right. Let me get. I feel guided to get a soul journey actually, and then I'll close it. I mean, somebody's about to go through it financially, and that sucks. I mean, really, really does. I mean, it's all over the cards in here. All over the cards. All over. And the messages. 
um, bad, it looks like. You're about to go through bad financially. But you're about to, it looks like, meet somebody unexpected. Possible love interests or a group, so that's good. I mean, if y'all don't work out, maybe y'all can, you know, become friends and just stay friends. But um, you take it how it resonates. And then somebody's about to get hit on. Um, I don't know if it's the same person. I feel like it might not be. I feel that might be for different Tauruses. Um, but you take it how it resonates. Deep knowing and chopped wood. Deep knowing. Some Tauruses are very highly intuitive. They knew the bad biz business investment and the job loss was coming. Okay, I heard some Tauruses are highly intuitive. They knew the job loss and the um, bad business investment was coming, basically. Um, However, some Tauruses are going to get a huge break with a bad business investment because down the line, they're going to be able to sue particular people and get their money back. Oh, wow. I heard um, for a particular few Tauruses, um, uh, I heard you got, um, some of you, a particular few, um, you're going to be able to sue the people. This is for the bad business investments. Um, sue the people that basically put you in the bad business investment um, and get your money back. And that's wonderful. Many series of chain of events are going to happen regarding the situation. They're going, they're in the process of being exposed and they're going to be exposed in a huge way when this happens. Okay, I heard many series of chain of events are going to occur, <clears throat> have already occurred with the situation, and more are going to occur. I heard um, they're in the process of being exposed, and they're going to be exposed in a huge way, I guess, basically, when you basically tank down on this huge business investment. And basically, I'm assuming, it seems like when you take legal action against them. So they're going to be exposed in a much huger way once, it looks like, once you take the action, legal action against them. Because um, it sounds like somebody, for whoever this resonates with, put you in a horrible business investment. Um, and they knew it. It's exactly what it sounds like. They most certainly did. Okay, I heard they most certainly did. So they knew they put you in the bad business investment. So... But I heard from Spirit, basically, they're going to be exposed in a huge way once you take legal action against them. Of course, everybody has free will, and you can choose, you know, if you don't choose to take legal action against them, then that's obviously, you know, your free will. But I heard if you do, basically, they're going to be exposed in a freaking huge way. Um, so, for whoever that's for, apparently somebody needs to hear that. So, it seems like you're going to have the upper hand once you take legal action against them. Of course, you take it, you know, everybody has free will, you can take it or leave it, but I'm just... Apparently, somebody needs to hear that. The spirit message, I'm just saying. Somebody really needs to hear that. Is what I just heard. Somebody really needs to hear that. Okay, well, somebody really needs to hear that. Okay. And then chop wood. Really keep working hard, and you will get there. One step at a time. Okay, I heard really keep working hard, and you will get there one step at a time. So, you take a take it how that resonates. No, that could go resonate in different ways for many different people. You take it how it resonates. Um, that could be if you're in school. That could be um, in an employment situation. That could be in relationships. Um, you take that how that resonates. But I heard from Spirit, you keep working one step at a time like building blocks. Keep working, working, working. Chopping wood. It's like, I take that as a reader as like working hard at something. Chop, chop, chopping, chop, chop, chopping, chop, chop, chop. You know, you're working hard, you're working hard. But I heard from Spirit, take it one step at a time. So keep working hard, keep working hard, keep working hard. Um, and that could be anything, like I said, anything in life. It could be relationships, because relationships take lots of hard work. Um, or um, employment situation or education if you're in school. You take it how it resonates. All right, I'm showing you a long time. 
All right, we're done and done and done and done. I hope this helped for real, for real. For real. Um, donations super duper greatly appreciated. It's Hyper Sister 05. The link's in the description box below. I know it works because I get notifications um, whenever anybody donates to me. So just saying. Um, and that's it. I hope you guys, um, I hope this helped for, for, for real. Please let me know if it did. If you think anyone could benefit from these messages, if you wouldn't mind sharing these on your social media, whatever social media platform you use, like Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Mayway, Parlay, or any other ones I missed, I'd appreciate it. All right, I'll see you guys later, and namaste.